At nine weeks, the embryo starts to appear more distinctly human. Facial features continue developing, and the fingers and toes are clearly separated digits. The digestive system has formed and continues to grow, specifically the intestines, pancreas, bile ducts, gallbladder, and anus. Sexual differentiation starts with the internal reproductive organs. At 10 weeks, the embryo's head now contains the major brain structures. The brain grows and expands as it produces 250,000 new neurons each minute. Bone starts replacing skeletal cartilage. As the kidneys start working, the amniotic fluid now includes fetal urine. External genitals of female and male embryos are forming but remain structurally identical. At 11 weeks, the baby is considered a fetus rather than an embryo. Now that the early embryonic organ systems have developed, they will continue to grow and differentiate. Red blood cells begin forming in the liver. Sexual differentiation is ongoing, as is ossification, which is the process of bone development. The eyelids begin fusing shut. At 12 weeks, the fetal brain continues to grow and expand. The eyes are widely separated and the body is elongating. As the limbs lengthen, they will gradually become more proportional to the body. Fingernails start developing. The fetus swallows amniotic fluid. Fetal waste products exit the amniotic fluid by passing across the placental membrane. At 13 weeks, the active fetus still moves uncontrollably, though it may be able to put its thumb into its mouth. The fused eyelids protect the developing eyes, which are moving closer together. The fetal intestines now grow within the abdomen rather than the umbilical cord. The liver keeps producing red blood cells until this process begins in the spleen.